to support Centaur, and we're going to see S4 Bane Core coming up right now. I became level 2 and did so much damage, but hold on. Might Bottom see a dead lane. Phoenix. Yeah, Here comes a Sent Sun, and yeah, that's a guaranteed kill. Nicely executed, and that's the good thing that Nightmare does here. It guarantees our stun from Centaur, and then you can follow it up with Chen Creeps. Yep. Meanwhile, it's going to be the... Earthshaker spots the, the room, bat. Yeah, they see him. There's a He rotation. could die. Here comes the oh, assassinate. assassinate. Boom! You get the kill. Zai goes okay. down, and it looks like LC good. Get the he's level 6, and it's 6 minutes in. So he's going to be completely fine here, and he's going to pick up a lane as well. Kuroki. Boom. Shot in his eyeless face as the Bane. Top lane. And do they have vision? They don't have any vision at the top of this river. They might not see S4 coming. Prophet actually ganking on the bot lane, trying to get a kill on Kuroki here. But he does get nightmared right away. Bit more diving, but actually a lot of damage on Phoenix. Couple more right clicks. Test of faith, and that's going to clean up the Phoenix. Big kill on the bot lane. In the meantime, they're ganking on top lane as well. Lasso on top of Wind Ranger and S4 initiating. They don't do enough damage, actually. They stop right clicking. Oh. That's going to be S4 falling almost for sure here. Assassinate, maybe he's going to save it for the next here. It's going to be Batrider or Shaker looking to Fissure. He's going to drop the Fissure. Will we see the Assassinator, or is he? Oh, great blocking. No Firefly for 8 seconds or so, and the body blocking nice. is going to be enough. No Shackle Latch, but here comes the damage. And what a play from LC. They lose a kill on the bot lane. But it's a position seeing that Centaur kind of dancing behind the mid lane. He now has his Morbid Mask. So Stun on the bot lane. Croaky's in trouble. Oh boy, they're making the go. He's so Spartan dead. Spartan cuts him off inside the side shop, and your Bane will be toasted. Yeah, that, Phoenix will go down. That Phoenix good, will get the kill. The good animation that Bane has is pretty much just completely screwed over by the, the minus attack. All smoked up. He's thinking about it. He's going to he go for it, actually. He's going for the kill. Great fissure just in time from him, but wow. there's the stampede. Will they catch him? I think the centaur will be able to get this. He gets a little bit of a speed burst out of this. They pick him off. <laughs> and uh, a good reaction from the Earthshaker, but yeah. it wasn't quite fast enough. That was the dream fissure. Boots. He doesn't uh -oh. have a mech. Mid lane, they get an easy grab with the help of Zai coming in from yeah. the north. The lasso setup after RTZ jumps in and quickly secret take this game back and move ahead seven to five. That's a game disadvantage. Or they're doing a smoke initiation. We even have a little bit of a speed creep coming from the Cobalt End. They're gonna be going in. There's the ulti as well. Another ult coming from Bane, and that secures a sniper kill. Fissure's gonna block off RTZ, but he doesn't have a blink for seven seconds. It's actually kind of dangerous for him. If they can get an initiation trees. No trees. They're fine. Our team's Prophet's gonna walk not away. six yet, so it's not really helping a huge amount at the moment. Oh, they get might Zai. get a kill. Yeah, top lane. They had the latch beautifully connected right there. Dara on the win range. Actually moving partially towards that direction, but I, stealing Roche is so dangerous here. I don't think S4 can do this. So no, they would need to have Zai also nearby, and he just he did just TP the bottom lane, but it's it's far too late. LC get there. Maybe if they spread out, there's the smoke. They're looking for one. They actually spot the sniper, but he has Aegis. They don't want to go to him. Big double edge coming. Hits two people, Whoa. but we got a supernova coming out. Batrider running for his life. Luckily running over the trees, but he may die to this ass. He actually gets canceled here. Great stun. Nightmare on top of Sniper to keep him alive. And now Kroki can use his ulti, but he wants to wait until he respawns. And he's going to go down 15 HP, I think, here. Puppy cleans him up. We'll see a grip coming from long range and safety. Assuming he has mana, and he does. Here comes the grip. Doesn't even bother with it. Nope. Brain saps. Nope. It's like, yeah. we don't care. We're so far ahead. And a bit of arcanes on Puppy is all Kuro needs for mana pool. He went Tranquil's Wand with a Null Talisman, boosts up his mana pool. And the pure damage really showing off. That's Brain Sap does pure damage, guys. It means it's not reduced by anything, so... Yeah, it's... It does wake. If you can spot Earthshaker here, it's going to be huge. Sees him. There it is. Stampede as well. Pulls him out of position, and that's going to be a dead ES. Great initiation there. Secret. Shackle's going to latch. Good force staff on RTZ. Should keep him alive for a bit. He's going to be evading some things. Headshot. He's so dead. Wow. And he got power shot. Two snipers here on the side of LC with that power shot and assassination yeah. in hand, and they actually get the connection moving forward. Kuro should be fine, I think. He's S4 got Tranquil Boots. Full mana. Oh, great stun. TP. Okay, okay. They catch him, no shackle. Oh, the force actually oh, he catches puts him there. In the latch. Oh, God, that's not He's going to send him want. back. Might have some great nightmare as well. Super good interaction here. And a supernova. And now Spartan getting burned up. They got to get the hell away from that egg. All right. And he goes down. Oh, he got a kill, connects. though. Yeah, flame break. They end up taking him down. The burn goes on through. It ends up being a two for one on the back end of what was already a long winded engagement in this bottom lane. Yeah. So that's the major synergy that Secret has in this game. It's the Chen send back with the, with the Nightmare. Nightmare has just doesn't have a long vision range. And Sent's going to die here. I think he's not going to get out of this. He does go down. Good catch. Yeah. Nature's Prophet rotates in, quickly uses the situation to make a push happen. They want to go for this tier one top lane, but Secret, they'll just dive in, be a bit more bloodthirsty with someone like Puppy, though, at playing his Chen. You can kind of afford to be a, a bit more ballsy. Here we go. 
Oh, smoke immediately popped from Spartan Whoa. shows up. Hi, guys. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess I wasn't supposed to be there. He goes down immediately. I think LC needs to get the hell out. They actually consider moving forward, and he used the egg. So, Nature's Prophet goes down. Supernova goes on to cooldown. Secret are like, um, okay. Well, we wanted to smoke, but we got to kill. Now, S4 might get more. Stun, warm welcome to relax. And relax. Gets slashed apart. Arteezy gets that kill. It's going to get lashed, but Lasso catches Madara. One by one, LC moves in, and they get caught. Sniper can't afford to move on forward. There's going to be the hand of God. They get oh, the sleep great on grip. the skanks. And the... Oh, nice Echo is going to be canceling that Fiend's grip that was on Madara. Could have killed her easy. And Secret making him pay. Get a hold of skanks here. Right click. Connects. Kuro gets that kill. 18 to 10 now for Secret. Oh, they Kuro's get the last one to dead. Kuro. Oh, maybe not. Oh, wow. Big couple of stuns there. Maybe Brain Tap on four seconds. Good save, actually. Yeah. S4, man. The Bodyguard. Moves in, saves his ally, gets to walk away with his life. And they might not get to walk away with theirs. Spartan just got back. He's dead again. There's the brain set more HP. Great shackle catching the two heroes left over. S4 is going down, and Zai as well is going to fall. Really well done. Secret stayed just a bit too long. All of their heroes had like 20% HP, and they still pushed it, and they end up getting punished for it. I think the kill on the Prophet was really good, but that shackle was... So big. Yeah. I mean, think about that shackle landing. Two heroes together, 3.75 seconds. That's the value of the hero that justified him getting or her getting picked all the time in the past. It's, yeah. If that shackle didn't land, that's two less heroes dead at maximum one hero killed. Like value crimson guard after all. Good shackle on Zai. Yeah, there we go. Yes. Another beautiful shackle connecting from Madara on to Zai. You know what's really happening here? It's not necessarily. A, I mean, Zai is out of position. You could say, but. It's really the fact that Batrider's vision range is, was start nerfed so much. His yeah. daytime vision is really weak. Uh, it's much less than a regular hero. So he's not, he just actually doesn't see those ganks coming, guys. It's not that he's just a bad player. Just his hero can only see it in MKB, which he is building. Change creeps are going to spot out the enemy team, so they will lose these two creeps for that. Although, maybe a Sentinel D going on the top lane, it's going to be a dead Prophet, the most underfarmed hero in the game. So they're basically trading a Roche for a potential tier two tower but man this is dying so fast that's agonims on wind ranger she's attacking rapidly doing tons of damage will they catch her and they have no stampede either it's gonna fall i think great fissure block it's so close oh, that's a good egg. he's dancing and yeah the egg on the high ground which you can't really see it's gonna create the extra bit of space they're gonna leave the ring of a quill behind and just get the hell out of there and arteezy is gonna be left behind oh long jump they are able to get the catch right there they take out the earth shaker so they do lose an extra life, but they that's, get their Aegis overall and leave. That's not that bad for C. Those are hacks right there. Um, <laughs> the Aegis is on Sniper, by the way, so they can't jump on him, but they're, Secret's doing a really good job targeting the correct person in the fight. They're going in. There it is. It's going to be Wind Ranger, actually, but she had Nightmare up. Arteezy pops to BKB. His HP's at about half. A lot of fire damage coming through. Secret's going to disengage for just a second here. Might see a fish. Oh, great Fiend's grip on top of their shake. If they can kill him right here, that's huge. Yes, they can oh, definitely God, turn the fight now. Going after the Prophet, he gets crit down. Sniper in trouble. Oh, if they can double kill Sniper here, it's going to be so big. Phoenix is in the back, going to try to slow things down, but he doesn't have the egg, and Arteezy can clean that up. Sniper running for his life, but Secret is diving. Boom. They still got to kill the Tier 2, but, man, they're going to back up and continue the game. That is some talent right there that we just saw. Like That's They had an Aegis, and they just outplayed him. They just ran over him. They Literally really did. ran over him, and they squashed think S4 really knew where they were or something. I'm not sure. Yeah, it's a bit awkward. And this is feeling like I don't I don't want to label it as a desperate smoke, but I do. It just feels like LC are like, yeah, yeah we gotta smoke and find something to get this game back. And they are trekking and they don't see anyone. Like, even, where the hell are they? Even if they find somebody, it's going to be tough. They've got a Shackle. All right, smoke breaks, but it's natural. Will they find Arteezy? Here comes Shackle. It's going to catch him. Nice. Arteezy in trouble. Focus fire. Good force staff from S4. Fissure's still going to land, though. He's low. He, oh, the Echo Slam is used. Oh, I don't no. know. Oh, he to catch Zai. Blink. He caught Zai. He doesn't have a blink. He just wanted to stop Zai. Secret. Oh. Arteezy uses BKB, though. Needs more. And I think he might get... Oh, barely staying alive. Focus fire. There is the Fiend's grip as well. It guarantees the Windrunner. At least stays alive the whole time. Ah, Unbelievable. That was Zai coming in, disrupting the damage yeah. by a little bit there. Uh, the Echo Slam was to try to delay the the uh, Flaming Lasso, but it just wasn't quite enough damage. Like, yeah. 
that we needed an MKB on the Wind Ranger. It's the same issue that we ran into with the the last game with yep. Wind Ranger versus the Shadow Fiend, who had the Butterfly. It's just it really limits your damage. Evasion is the counter to this, basically. Yep. And, but what you, what he maybe needed to buy, he had to get Maelstrom, and he really did oh need God. MKB. Oh, oh God! Oh my gosh! No respect. Arteezy jumps in, gets that godlike kill on the back of a huge crit on the sniper. He is out one minute, no buyback, and the relentless onslaught doesn't stop. They slaughter the nature's prophet. Oh, is Ice gonna be left alone? I'm like, he's like, guys, we probably could have taken yeah, that egg, but no. they don't want to do it. Now Arteezy stuck between a tower. Ooh, <laughs> bad blink. He's gonna over. die. He gets stuck in behind and hands over a huge bounty to Earthshaker. He just got a thousand gold. Okay. It's no blink still though. Yeah, not enough for the blink, unfortunately. But this is all the. The sloppy catch all the kills, you know. Got to make sure those obs are got they're important for something. So here we go. Top lane though, they make the rotation got up the there. Eels, and there's the grip. Okay. That should Welcome be a to kill. the lane. <laughs> and see you later. I don't agree with Prophet showing up here. Oh, never mind. They're chasing. Can they, they catch the anybody? Sleep? They use the urn, but Crows Rod of Atos as well. They might be able to catch him, but PA goes in, pops the BKB. Who's he want to go for? It's the egg. That egg is gonna die. Couple hits. He's got Mask of Madness on. It's a lot of hits, but he does finish it off. Wind Ranger running to safety if possible, but no wind run for two seconds. He'll be in trouble. Shackle it's catches over. Arteezy. Good game is called. LC just having too much trouble getting a kill there. Yule's even on Crow to keep alive, and they just Oof. man. That, that fight by the mid-tier 2 where they ran at him, there just wasn't a whole lot they could do. They just charged him right down. Yeah. Got the kills. That grip set things up. And I think it, like, Secret set the tone that game from when LC tried to go in and get that Roche done. Yeah. And Secret were like, 